presentation uh, this week at Farm Tech 2013 about seed quality in Chile in, in, in terms of canola. Is it different in Chile than it would be in the Northern Hemisphere? No, not at all. Um, in fact, um, the growing conditions there are equal to, if not better than the conditions we have in, in Canada. And my purpose of being there is to facilitate the ease of the movement of the seed coming back into Canada. So I'm testing seed for purity and germination on site in Chile, um, putting the documents together and then ensuring that those um, shipments are made quickly and we're getting on those fruit boats essentially that yeah. um, do the, the quick trip up here. So when, I, so when I go to my local retailer and I buy that bag of seed, it really shouldn't matter to me. I shouldn't even need to ask the question whether it was grown here or in South America? No, not at all because, um, and that was, you know, there was a few questions yesterday after I'd finished speaking about, you know, what's the quality like, a little bit of concern over, um, were we introducing Aster Yellows, was black leg being brought into the country? And essentially, Chile has the beauty of having the the sea and then the Andes and they're very very clean in terms of diseases they export everything they don't import anything and just the the, the way the nature of the way that the land lies um, you know the quality of any product coming out of there is exceptional and of course the whole Aster yellow thing well um, up until yesterday I didn't know that it could be uh, moved by sea but I've essentially not seen anything like that